We are back with a living legend. Rita Moreno has been capturing the hearts of fans throughout her career from a groundbreaking performance in West Side Story, which, of course, earned you an Oscar to a raucous Super Bowl a weekend in 80 for Brady. And now, now she's going in a different direction. She's got a dark comedy. It's called The Prank. And Rita plays a high school science teacher with a chip on her shoulder and a bone to pick with a cheating student. Take a look. When I release the bowl, it creates a pendulum effect. It swings from gravitational potential energy to kinetic energy and back. Do you trust physics, Mr. Palmer? No, wait. Look at that woman. Look at that woman. Okay, Rita. Ah! Rita, you are playing such a mean, nasty. I would call her a b Oh, God. Okay, well. She is the world's <laughs> meanest woman. I had so much fun. You did? But you know what was fun? What? Picking that hairdo. What you was know, that bowl cut? Ba- yeah, it's, it's that little Dutch boy. Yeah, that yeah. The bang. too short. Yes. We got a wig, and I said to the, the, the lady, I said, yeah. Let's cut it short because there's nothing not less attractive than a very short bang. <laughs> so I have a question. And she kept cutting and I kept saying more, shorter, more. shorter. So who did you model this character after? You oh, have to have known some meanies well, in your life. All the nasty women I've ever known in my life. And there are a few of them in show business, there are. as we know. But she this woman, this character is so Evil. Evil. Love, it's really a cult movie. Yeah. But it's funny. <laughs> it's also, what's moving? I don't know. Everything is going crazy around us. <laughs> don't pay attention to the things <laughs> behind us. But it's really, yeah. I, it's funny. It's, I laughed. I saw it once yeah. on the screening. Yeah. And my daughter and I, Fernanda and I, laughed at me so much. She is just so wicked. It's ooh, that, that's you. Hey, is that gorgeous? That is go- that is gorgeous. You look at so the hands. tell this thing you shot a while back, right? Yeah, yeah. You shot this movie a while back, and, right. and it's just coming to fruition right, today. Right, right. I have to tell you, I love you for many, many reasons. This movie is just shows your range because. But I remember when I sat down with you and did a really long, in-depth interview. Oh. And I was so blown away by you on so many ways. I was blown away how you just. Described yourself as a little girl way back in the day. You described yourself as unworthy and without value. That's, that's how, how I you felt saw. About that's myself. how you saw yourself. Right. You were. You came came to this country from Puerto Rico and felt othered. Well, you know, the people in the streets taught me that. Yeah. That's how they made me feel, and uh, it took me a very long time to get over the feeling that I was an unworthy person and that, uh, that I wasn't pretty and. Uh, that I was Latina was a big, big deal. So for many years, I didn't like being a Hispanic person. I mean, wow. that's how I grew up. When I was five, I learned that I was not a good person, and I couldn't understand why. But, you know, you're young. Young people are very tender. Yeah. And uh, they believe everything they hear. Seems Someone very- says you're not no good. You accept that. You may not know why someone thinks that way, but you accept it because you're young. Yeah, because I was just thinking, I mean, there are so many people who are children of immigrants. I'm a child of an immigrant. There are so many people who are immigrants now. Yeah. And I think often you do feel sort of like, wow. How, so how did you find your voice and say, I, I love who I am now? How long do you have? It <laughs> took forever. Yeah. It really took forever because that's ingrained in you when you're very young. Yeah. So it's going to take a, as long a time, really. I was in therapy and I was... And, and psychotherapy. And, I, you know, I really, I, I think it works very well mm-hmm. if you get the right doctor, mm-hmm. obviously. Mm-hmm. And I'm not even espousing it. If you don't like the idea, talk yeah, to an uncle, do, talk to a priest. To a, talk know, to somebody. Some, but talk to somebody. Well, I like to see what can happen. I mean, yeah. after all of those feelings about yourself, here you sit, you're 92, you've got all these different roles. You did 80 for Brady. You're doing this this movie now. You have something else down and the I'm pipeline. I'm going to do soon. Yeah. It's a movie called Theirs, and it's a horror film. Oh, there you go again. <laughs> maybe, I'm starting, maybe I'm starting a new career. So what, is, like, I feel like you have an endless amount of curiosity. I'm wondering, like, how, because your spirit is 15 years old when I sit with you. Oh, yes. Your spirit right. is, is young. How do you keep that? 
Well, and I'll tell you something. That's easy. No. That's so much a part of my nature, truly. Yeah. I love to laugh, and I love to make people laugh. Yes. And uh, so that's 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 not a problem. Yeah. Uh, my problem is is getting serious sometimes. Yeah. Really. Because I have a very big <laughs> sense of humor. Yes, you do. And I can find uh, ha-has in almost <laughs> everything. So, I mean, the, my favorite subject to make fun of is me. Really? Yeah, because I do some really <laughs> stupid things. You're, a, you're such an awesome... I always feel better after sitting with you. You've got sparkles in your hair. I got that from and, my daughter. And your daughter's here? Are these here? cute where or is, what? Where is your daughter? Is she here? Yeah, come here. Can you guys... Come on, just come over. Come over Might here. Might as well just walk over. Yeah. By the way... What a lovely human being, too. Just a real This quick. is Fernanda. Fernanda, hey. how are you? Pleasure. How, how is it having this woman as your mother? This is fun. This is the best. This is a good life. This is, we, and we're best friends, and we travel, and we just have a ball. This is my baby girl. And we both sparkle. Well, and she's always my date for big deal things, wow. like the Oscars. She'll be at the Oscars with me. Yeah. yeah tell me about your role at the Oscars. Well, I'm going to be a presenter. I know. <laughs> what you, you can't say what you're presenting, right? No, I'm not okay. allowed to. Okay. Well, whatever it is, it's going to be spectacular. But I got to tell you, look for me because I'm going to wear a gown that's going to knock your socks off. <laughs> I am. You, you, it's Dolce & Gabbana. I might as well tell you. Go, oh. girl. Ah. We're so, we are. I mean, the Puerto Rican is wearing a Dolce & Gabbana. <laughs> Come on, girl. <laughs> Thank you. I love you so much. I'm so happy you came. Are I'm you excited. saying goodbye to me? Well, I don't want to, but you're going to be back again on the third hour. But you got to see Prank, you guys. This woman is the prank. The prank. This woman is terrifying. March 15th. <laughs> All right. Savannah, over to you. Oh, no. We just want to stay on the Rita yeah, channel, right. don't we? All day long. We love you, channel. Rita. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day or click the link right here.